But does any other maggot out there ever want to just say slip cannot? <laughs> like oh, slip yeah. cannot because of the case. <laughs> slip cannot. I do that with a lot of words. Hey, they say that I'm talking a whole lot of trash. I'm sitting and thinking like, who knew? I know that you've seen us on rappers react. They're talking about us on YouTube. Hollywood sticks, it look like I do magic. Maybe he's practicing voodoo. I'm hearing you're getting a lot of attention. Well, I'm here to say that we do to deliver the rubbish. I'm What's going on, everybody? We're back with another segment of Rappers React. Shmoda. What up? So, got some more wrestling trivia for you. What you got? Now, we know who this guy is, but I'm just curious if you know if you can tell me anything other about his his alter ego or what his finisher might be. Tell me something about the Blue Blazer. The Blue Blazer, that was Owen Hart. Mm -hmm. And he also did the sharpshooter like Brett's. They have something else lifted, listed. As the Blue Blazer? I couldn't even yes. tell you what his finisher was as the Blue Blazer. I don't even... I, get, I bet you if I said it, you would know it. You ready? Yeah. Reverse pile driver. Oh, God. That's what... Yeah, yeah that's what... Stone Cold Stone could tell Cold. you about but that. But that's when he yes. was Owen Hart, though. That wasn't when yeah. he was the Blue Blazer. Yeah. I guess he did that move a lot, right? But he didn't do it after that, I'll tell you that. Because, why? you know, well, he died as the Blue Blazer. Yeah, from the rafters. Rest in peace, yeah. Owen Hart. Yeah. But why did... Why did they change him to the Blue, Blue Blazer? Why didn't... Was it like, because you know Vince McMahon would do that thing where it's like if you, like when he did with Goldust and turned him yeah. to seven. Like yeah. he would. Everybody he brought in, like he would bring in these superstars from around the world and make them a, a garbage man or a plumber or something like that. Why? Yeah. I don't I mean, know, man. He was weird. Look at it like this. He brought The Undertaker in, who was my favorite wrestler of all yeah, time. Yeah, that gimmick worked. As a mortician yeah. or a yeah. dead guy. And yeah, as an Undertaker. Yeah. With him. Yeah. All right, so. Let's say you go to Columbia and you get some pure coke ain. Uh, probably shouldn't have said that. <laughs> probably not. Yeah. But uh, in order for you to do it, you have to do something with it. Chop it. All right. Um, so, okay. Man, there's too much. Um, there's too much. Um, there's too much uh, vinegar in this. We need to add some water to. To uh, lessen it, disperse it. Uh, uh, you get start with a D. To to uh, all right, let's see. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, okay, one uh, okay. You've got a dice, and then one single dice is called a, a die. Die. Okay. Uh, if Di dilute, dilute it. You got it, ah. my friend. <laughs> Guys, before we get started, please do us a big, big, big favor. Y'all, please hit that thumbs up button. Guys, please subscribe to the channel. And for God's sake, leave us a comment and tell us what to react to next. That's how we get the ideas for these videos. It comes directly from you right down in the comment section. And today, it's time to step into the snare and mingle with the maggots because it's Slipknot Saturday. It's Slipknot. Not Saturday. So yeah, yeah, guys, just a peek behind the curtain. Whenever we, uh, we we know, like every Saturday morning, we come over, we get our breakfast. You know, we've learned to. We're gonna try this today. We have not had our coffee yet because mm -hmm. this this is off of Red Jumpsuit album. Because last Slipknot not Saturday, it just our hearts were just pounding. It's like okay, <laughs> dude, we gotta let's get our dose of Slipknot in, but then we can have our coffee and our breakfast. Yeah. But does any other maggot out there ever want to just say Slip cannot? <laughs> like oh, slip yeah. cannot because of the case. <laughs> slip cannot. I do that with a lot of words, I'm like knife. You know, knife. If they put a silent in there, a silent letter, I want to pronounce it. Yeah, like salmon. Salmon. Yes. <laughs> like don't put it in there if, if I ain't it don't supposed belong to say there. It. Yeah, I got you. I got you. There's a like a man. Knee. Or like you know etouffee, um, the French curio occasion thing. To me, that was always uh. a weird one. Like, the way it's spelled, etouffee. Uh. But no. Is that a food? Yeah. Uh. Yeah, I don't think I've had it. Oh, it's delicious. Well, you don't... Most of it has... Uh, Seafood? Yeah. Uh. I mean, it's like a gumbo kind of... I just... Uh. Yeah. But no. All right, so... Red Jumpsuit album. Yeah. Your favorite. Yeah. Turn the f up. Yes, that's it. That's why there has not been any coffee, and we apologize <laughs> if yeah. we, you know, we ain't turned up on as we normally are on our Saturdays. But I mean, 
It's red jumpsuit, dude. Yes, we will be turned up after this. I'm sure. What Tell if? Tell you that. What if Slipknot said, "Uh, uh-uh, uh, not today, you ain't." Uh-uh. Oh, we just gonna do a slow ballad, you know, singing about my mom or something. Yeah. yeah. No, it's not gonna happen. Not on red jumpsuit. No, I don't see nope, it happening. Nope, nope. So diluted. Mm-hmm. What you got? Uh, now remember, remember what the basically the the angle of this album is. Yes, is he saying society has been diluted by something? Hmm. Or is he saying we will not be diluted by society because we are independent from your society? Shmoda. What up? Let's get into it. Let's do it. <laughs> See what I mean? You see what I mean? God, this is when Joey was just monstrous. Coffee isn't needed. Not at all, no, man. Not at all. I mean, it, it's it, just a thousand every time, like uh, straight to a thousand. I mean, I'll say there's probably been like three, four, maybe five songs where slips not just all, where they're not just all in your face. Yeah. Where it's just like, all right, we're gonna chill, we're gonna chill, but ninety percent of the time, I'm yeah, gonna get on the top 95. rope and elbow drop. Yeah. Ninety five percent of the time, yeah. And it's always like, it's never like, let's warm up into it. It's no. just. Boom! Right in your face! Yes. Man, it's, um, like, 
it's just, I mean, I don't even think I need my coffee, too, to be honest <laughs> no, with you, dude. Not after the, man, if you uh, are tired, like you just wake up and you got to go to work and you on the way to work, you're like, oh, can't even open my eyes. Play some slip yes. See if that don't crank and, your ass and, up. And, and do dilute it. I would say do dilute it. <laughs> yeah. I would like to know what track number this is. And I'm not going to look it up, Maggots. You guys can let us know yeah. what what number this is on there. I, I really feel like, you know, once we are fully done with Red Jumpsuit album and we can listen from point or song A to, to soint, uh, soint, to soint. point Z, when we soint can listen Jackie. to the whole <laughs> whole album, I just I, I just want to see how these songs flow with each other. Yeah. Because some of them are just like, it, all right, it, it goes and then it's at 10 and it stops. And then the yeah. next song, it goes and then 10 and then it stops. It's, it's just like, like blocks. Yeah. It's just... Straight up, over, down. Straight up, <laughs> over, over, down. down. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. That's that's Red Jumpsuit album. They they should not even put. I don't know if they did, but they should not even put spaces. No. Like just one track bleeds into the other, and it's just one hundred through the entire Dude, album. What if they did that? What if that's how they recorded this album? They just <laughs> yeah. stayed in the studio for like an hour and ten minutes and just made one <laughs> just long song stopped. and just said, "All right, chop that up at five minutes and four seconds. All right, chop this yeah. up at two minutes. All right, chop this at eight minutes, and <laughs> you get Red Jumpsuit album." Yeah, that's crazy. All right, yeah. What is this about? I, well, I think rather than him pointing out that we are not your kind like usual i think this is actually his frustration of being outcasted from society man i i got a religious aspect from it like he's yeah. he was I mean, talking well about, it could be religion also yeah it could be when he's, he said uh your silence is your blessings you know he said you know basically i would come to you for questions and you didn't return anything mm-hmm. i mean there was a part where he said oh uh, what did he say but he he entered the line with boy and then bitch, hmm. like he was talking about a man and a woman. So it kind of makes me wonder if he's talking about a mixed congregation or maybe his parents. I wonder what his uh, oh wow his home life was like. You know, I'd be willing to say, and maggots, leave it in the comments. I'd, I'd be willing to say Corey grew up in a pretty good whole household. You would, I mean, yeah, you would think. Iowa, well, I mean, middle. I mean, the, the boy, I mean, well, I can't even say that because he's older than me, but. The man had a lot of aggression, though. Yeah, well, maybe something happened. Maybe that's the thing. Maybe his entire life he was treated well and was coddled, and you know, maybe went to private school. So it's like, you know, just be calm. Don't don't raise your voice. Yeah. Now that I'm an adult, stifled the now, entire time. Now that I'm I'm not with this band or I'm with this band Stone Sour, but now that y'all got me in Slipknot and I can wear a mask <laughs> yeah. and I'm with these crazy mofo's behind me. Oh, <laughs> yeah. My whole life I've been silenced. This y'all finna hear some shit. Yeah, you know. Yeah, yeah. I don't know, man. It's it, it, Saturday mornings, dude. <laughs> Saturday mornings are just like Saturday mornings with Slipknot. <laughs> yes, that's yeah. that's it. Saturday north morning with Slipknot and the maggots and guys. Amazing, amazing Slipknot Saturday mm-hmm. again. Um, yes, let us know what your interpretation is of the song Diluted and let us know what's next by Slipknot down in the comment section. And with that being said, my name's Barrage of Hollywood. Six, bye. I am Larry Smoke It Ramirez Cowan. And we are over and out. Deuces. Yeah, yeah. Get my pork. I wanted to be like, Larry Smoke It Ramirez Cowan. Boo. We want to thank you guys for tuning in to Slipknot Saturday and allowing us to mingle with the maggots. If you want to check out last week's Slipknot Saturday, it's going to be right over here. If you want to check out another artist that we've covered, it's going to be right over here. Thank you guys so much. We are really enjoying this Slipknot Saturday. We will see you next week. Deuces.